We had gone to an ear, nose, and throat doctor several years ago, and the doctor told him that chewing tobacco doesn't cause oral cancer, that you have to have a predisposition for it. Chewing tobacco doesn't cause oral cancer. Chewing tobacco doesn't cause oral cancer. Chewing tobacco doesn't cause oral cancer, that you have to have a predisposition for it. Yo, what's up? You got your boy Uncle Chubb here coming at you live, live from the captain's live, chair. Y'all know exactly live. how to do it. Today we got some uh, Gold River. It's been a long time since I've done this one. It's right there. It's one of my uh, personal favorites. So let's go ahead and get this thing uh, crack a lacking. Get this video started. Got all to talk about. Hope y'all are doing well. I'm alive. That's all I can say for me. <laughs> hey, that's a good thing, ain't it? All right. Let's talk about a few things today. Um, uh, the intro about the lady passing away due to uh, cigarette smoking, uh, cancer, if you will. Um... That was by far one of the most hardest and one of the most, one of the most saddest intros that I've ever done. Um, I had to be really careful when, when I put that together because um, just about all my intros and pretty much my videos in general are pretty much like done in a comedic way. And the last thing I wanted uh, my viewers 
is to see something like that and think that I was, you know, trying to make light of that situation or trying to make fun of that situation because I definitely was not. Um, I took that segment and, and handled it with care, if you will. Um, I tried to be respectful as I possibly could. And, um, you know, it's, it's no laughing matter. And um, I had to be really careful on, on how I did that. So I didn't want to show no disrespect um, toward that piece, toward her. And uh, maybe she have family and friends and loved ones who may be watching this video. You never know. Or maybe you yourself, you the viewer, uh, may have brother, sister, husband, wife, um, you know, grandparents, uh, family, friends who may have passed on uh, due to cancer of any type of cancer, not just smoking from smoking or, you know, just any type of cancer in general. So uh, my sympathies goes out to all those who have lost loved ones and and. You know, the whole bottom line was I tried to be respectful to that particular piece as I possibly could. Um, a lot of you that are watching this video who smoke, you're probably going to sit there and say, well, how can you say dipping is 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 better than uh, smoking, pretty much? I'm not going to say it's actually better, but I will say that a can of this you will most likely live a lot longer than you would doing this right here. I mean, as a matter of fact, this is what I want y'all to do. This is what I want you to do right here. I want you to go to your local hospital. Some of you may have two hospitals in your area. But I want you to go to your local hospital. Okay? Every hospital has at least six or more floors. And all those floors are dedicated to certain people with certain illnesses. You know, you're going to have a floor that's dedicated with, uh, to people that are HIV and, and have AIDS. You're going to have people that are dedicated to, um, like, Alzheimer's or other different types of ailments and other different types of disease. And one of those floors you're going to find, you know, people that are, that have, that are either dead or dying or really sick or freshly diagnosed with cancer. And the majority of it is from smoking. Okay? This is what I want you to do. I want you to go to that hospital and I want you to show me one floor just one floor in your entire hospital that's dedicated to people that has cancer because of this. Okay? That has cancer because of chewing tobacco. That has cancer because of dipping, period. Uh, snus, snooze, whatever you want to call it. You show me one floor that is, that is filled with people that are sick because of this. You're not going to find one because there isn't one. I can guarantee you that. Okay? You go to your hospital and you show me one person. One person that, are, that is dying because of this. Okay? In our country, we have people that are dying like every six or seven seconds because of smoking. And again, I'm not going to sit here and say this is better than smoking. I'm not going to sit here and say that it's a safer alternative, but I will say that you will live a happier, longer life than you would smoking. That's all I'm saying. You know, if you choose to smoke, I mean, that's on you. Nothing I can do about that. I'm not going to tell you to stop. Everybody has their own poison. This is mine. Smoking is yours. Okay? <laughs> so, ain't nothing I can say about that. True doctors, real doctors out there will tell you that this right here does not cause cancer. What happens is you already have cancerous spores and cells in your mouth and this right here just simply aggravates it. It doesn't cause it. Okay? Any real and true doctor will tell you that. Let me tell you something. 
there are doctors out there that do. There are dentists out there that do. Those are the ones that will really tell you the truth. Okay? I have seen countless interviews of these same people. I have seen countless interviews of the families of the, lo of the, the loved ones they lost. And not one single interview where they actually said that chewing tobacco and dip was the actual cause. The question that was always asked was, do you believe that's what it was that killed you? And they always say yes. They never said that it was actually the cause. They always said they believed that what it was that killed them. Sorry, folks. I mean, you've already just heard a snippet that I played that came from an actual wife that was trying to get her husband to quit smoking, so she decided to take him to a doctor, and the doctor told her that it doesn't cause mouth cancer, okay? You'd be surprised how many people out there that actually believe that this stuff right here will give you mouth cancer. No, it won't. It'll just aggravate the cancer that you probably already got, most likely. That's what it does. People need to do their research. Okay? That's all I'm saying about that. <laughs> I'm not really feeling good today. Um, I'm scheduled to go to the doctor shortly. So I wanted to make this quick video before I head on out. But before I go, let me say this right quick. Uh, a previous video or two, or maybe three, I talked a little bit about shout outs, but I think there's a few things that I left out. So I'm going to just say them right here. Okay? As far as shout outs is concerned, I don't mind giving shout outs. Okay? Especially to those that I think really deserve it because there's a few people out there that make pretty good videos. But if you have a YouTube channel with no videos at all, no, con no content at all, not even a profile picture, and you're asking for a shout out? No, it's not going to work. I do not shout out people who do not have a profile, who do not even have an account. I mean, they have an account, but there's nothing there. No videos, no content, no, no nothing. You know, you're not going to get a shout out like that. Okay? Number two, please try your best to get a better camera that has a higher resolution okay it's really hard for me to present your to present yourself in a shout out when your camera is just god awful okay try to get you a 1080p or no lower than a 720 okay today's cell phones have really really nice resolution so get you a better camera uh to make good quality videos okay doesn't have to be an extremely cam extremely expensive camera. Just get you a good, decent resolution camera. I mean, you can go to Walmart and get you a good, decent Logitech with a high resolution for like thirty bucks. It's not like y'all can't. It's not like you can't afford it. I mean, think about it. You spend more than thirty bucks a week on dip. So I know you can go out to, to Walmart and get you a good, decent camera. Okay. My webcam is kind of old. It's like several years old. You know, but it's pretty decent. So get your camera like that. Get your Logitech. They don't cost that much. If you want you a good, higher, uh, more expensive camera, more power to you. But if your pockets are not that deep, you can get you a good one for about 30 bucks at Walmart. Okay? And last but not least, you have to be patient. There is absolutely no way I can shout out every single person in one video. Sometimes it, make it, it might take a video or two, but sooner or later, I'll get to you, okay? I only shout out to people that I truly feel that that really deserves it, that puts just a little effort into their content and their videos or whatnot. It doesn't have to be extraordinary. You don't have to go all out or anything. Just be interesting. That's the main thing that really grabs me. As long as you got something interesting to talk about, that's good enough for me. You don't have to go balls out or anything like that. You know, if you do, then... You know, that's great because I like creativity, but just be interested. That's good enough for me. All right, that's all I got. Y'all take care and God bless. Y'all check us out on Dip University on Facebook. We have a we have a great time in there. We talk in there, talk shit. Uh, nobody judges you about what type of dip you like. We talk about anything. 
especially college football that's coming up. So you can bet your ass we're going to be talking about that <laughs> and the NFL. Y'all take care and God bless. I'm out of here. Y'all check me out on Instagram as well. Uh, speaking of Instagram, it's it's really a dip Instagram, but I post a lot of things on there that uh, that's not really dip related. I mean, there's a lot of things that I really like that that doesn't have anything to do with dip. I mean, some people just dedicate all their social media to just dip, and there's nothing wrong with that. You know, more power to them. But me, I like all different types of things. I'm a big fan of, uh, I like to, well, I don't hunt anymore. I used to, but I don't hunt anymore because of, you know, uh, medical situations and health situations and stuff like that. But I used to hunt. I like deer hunting. I like everything about it. I like the pictures. I like to watch the hunting shows. And I like to talk about it and stuff like that. So, you know, you find a lot of interesting shit on there. All right? All right, folks, I'm out of here. Y'all take care. God bless. Always remember, it ain't worth jack if you don't speak black. Pack your lips, load them clips. I'm out of here. We'll see you next video. Y'all take care. See ya. bonus round how can i beat the lizard and rhino but i can't beat this level gosh okay here we go focus focus peter got this and oh hey mj how's it going bring me the symbiote or she dies huh who the heck was that time to get serious Hey, MJ. How's it going? Are you okay? Oh, good. You look great, by the way. Shh. Just stay calm, and I'll have you out of here in no time. MJ! Give me the science, boy. You do not know which true. Power. Symbiote? Oh, was I supposed to bring that for you? I sense a dark presence about you. Oh, that's because I had some fish tacos earlier, and they are not sitting well. I would definitely not go to Kirby's Crab Shack. No, this no, no, no. This is no, not no. a game! Okay, 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 okay. I hear you. I think you're looking for this? Ah, that's what I thought. I'll trade you this for the girl, okay? On the count of three. You have numbers where you're from, right? Where are you from? Okay, I've upset you. Never mind, here we go. Three, two... One, catch! <laughs> Too slow! MJ, run! Oh boy. That looks dangerous. Whoa. I know, you're from Asgard, right? Hey! Savage Land? Genosha? Wakanda? Near Iron? Whoa! Too slow! Nah, 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 nah. Can't touch this. How about Latveria? The negative zone? Silence! Hot! Hot! Up and over. Give me a clue. A hint? Anything? I know. You're from Jersey, right? I guess not. Ouch! Whoa! Gotcha! Incoming! Hey, you noisy kids. Keep it down. You wouldn't want me to get angry, would you? Whoa! Time to end this light show! Hey, Hornhead! You like baseball? Hey, batter batter swing! I'll take that! Whoa! Oh, we're really strong! Here's web in your eye! Time to unleash the awesomeness! What? Huh, here we go! Hold on one second. Wait. Why can't I figure this out? Uh, you know what? Never mind. Let's see how well you do without this cool flashlight of yours. Ow, 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 ow! Hey! My web's 
shooters. You know how much these cost? That's it. Ouch. Hang on. I'm not ready. That is the worst sunburn I have ever seen. This is...